Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Saman here, your grammar teacher. Today we are going to solve a paper of IKSC 2020. This is Equilier level class 3 and 4. So let's start with it. Uh, first there is a picture and then after, after the picture there are some MCQs that we are going to solve. So let's start. Emma, Matt and Tick take a virtual trip to Australia. You should know that in the virtual world, scientists don't have to travel thousands of kilometers under the hot sun, in the rain or blizzard. It is enough for them to know what they are looking for or to go online and gather interesting information. This kind of virtual expedition began at Emma's house three days ago. They found out that in Australia it is summer when here it is winter. You can see in the picture Emma, Matt and Tick are there and mother is also here. Welcome, wash your hands before starting the expedition. We will have lunch at 1 p.m. You can see the time now it is 9.30 and at 1 p.m. they will have their lunch. And you can also see the day, uh, calendar. It's July 9 Thursday. Then there is a poster in which two penguins, they are wearing a knitted sweater. And here it is written, an Australian man knitted sweaters for dwarf penguins to protect them from oil pollution. Then on the shelf, you can see there are three um, stuffed toys, collar, penguin and kangaroo. And here, this is uh, Matt. Matt is saying, today we will look into animals from Australia's waters. Emma, I brought you a toy seal for your collection of Australian animal toys. Matt and Emma, I brought a book on the animals found in Australian waters. Uh, see, this is Tick and Tick is having a book in his hand and he is saying that he brought a book for the information. Penguins, seals and crocodiles live both on land and water. Now, you, can, you have to remember these animals, penguins, seals and crocodiles. They live in water as well as on land. Here you, uh, in the... Um, in the picture you can see on the screen there are three pictures of penguin then shark and the sea lion okay now let's start with mcqs uh, question number one is when the events from the picture take place it is winter in australia and in europe it is now here you can see in the last line it is written they found out that in australia it is summer when here it is winter it means that the the uh, 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 the seasons are opposite. If in Australia it is summer, then in Europe it is winter. If in Australia it is winter, then definitely in Europe it will be summer. So, summer is the correct option. It's the opposite season. When did the children begin their virtual expedition? We have seen it on the calendar. It was Thursday, July 9. An Australian man dressed dwarf penguins in sweaters so that so that they don't catch a cold. They can play with them. Uh, they keep warm or they don't get wet or they are protected from pollution okay um here on the poster i have i mentioned it here uh, he just uh, he were they were wearing the sweaters because penguins to protect them from oil pollution so the correct option is that they protected them from the pollution okay number four how much time do the children have to research the sea creatures of australia now uh, the time was 9 30 and uh, at 1 o'clock they have to come back so from 9 30 till 1 o'clock it becomes 1 2 3 3 hours and 30 minutes so 3 hours and 30 minutes is the correct option then on the left screen there is an image of kangaroo seal shark crocodile or penguin on the left side of the screen now we are talking about the screen so here we are having penguin you are not going to uh, to write over here collar because these are the stuffed toys they are talking about the screen so on the screen penguin is the is the is on the left side so penguin is the correct option okay then uh, what uh, what objects are lying around on the floor? You can see books, balls, slippers and teddy bears. Rest of the options are wrong. You can check from the picture. This option is correct. Number B. Which toy did Emma receive from Matt? Now you can see Emma received from Matt. This is Tick and this is Matt. Matt brought a seal for Emma. So here you can see that I brought you a toy seal for your collection of Australian toys. So seal is the correct option. Uh, Tick also found information about animals from Australia in a book from his grandparents in a movie on TV at the opera. In the picture you have seen that Tick is having a book in his hand. So in a book is the correct option. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन हाउ मेनी पैंगुन्स कैन यू सी इन द पिक्चर अबव नाउ यू हैव टू काउंट द पैंगुन्स विद मी एंड ऑलवेज रिमेंबर दैट यू हैव टू काउंट द बेबीज ऑल्सो इफ दे आर आई नी ओके पैंगुन नंबर वन दिस इज नंबर वन टू थ्री एंड नंबर फोर इज इन द Uh, is in the picture over here okay so there are four penguins in the picture what kind of animals in the picture above are seen only once which are uh, which are just seen once they are bear turtle and kangaroo here you can see also on the screen there is only one bear okay there is only one a uh, seal okay and there is only a uh, uh shark you can say that shark shark there are two shark tick is also wearing a shirt having a picture of shark okay so see eel these are the answers yes bear turtle and kangaroo turtle is on the shirt of uh, emma and then kangaroo the stuffed toy that is placed on the shelf so there are three before beginning the online expedition the children must first now you have seen what the mother was saying that first you have to here he uh, here she was saying that first you have to wash your hands before starting the uh, expedition so this is the answer first have to wash their hands number b option is correct look at the picture how many animals total are there in this picture okay now you have to count the total number of animals in the picture so let's start from here kangaroo number 1 2 3 4 5 then uh, 6 7 these are two this is a baby koala also 7 8 9 10 11 and then on the shirt 12 13 and the shark on the shirt 14 so there are 14 animals in the picture so 14 is the correct option 14 is the correct option okay now uh, there is another test second test the the sydney aquarium okay the children found the sydney aquarium on the internet in the aquatic world we find all kinds of animals fish oysters reptiles birds fish of all sorts reproduce by row row basically are the eggs that are eaten uh, the, uh, these are the eggs of fish that are eaten okay so fish of all sorts reproduce by row whales unlike fish give birth to live young Although penguins do not have feathers and do not fly but they are classified as birds birds octopuses and reptiles reproduce by laying eggs whales sea lions and the great white shark are endangered species being excessively hunted for meat fat or skin okay you have to remember these three animals whales sea lions and great white shark they are endangered okay now there is some description about the the uh, animals the little blue the little blue penguin is the smallest penguin species it can reach up to 40 cm and weighs 1 kg there is a gray blue stripe on its back it lives in very large colonies the royal penguin the royal penguin is the most colorful penguin it stands out by the yellow uh, feathering on the head and its white cheeks it can reach up to 70 cm and weighs 8 kg it lives in colonies okay both the penguins you have seen in the pictures or in on the tv also that they lives in colonies the australian sea lion is a mammal that prefers sandy beaches in secluded bays they gather in colonies on land it can reach up to 3 m in length and 300 kg in weight The great white shark lives in the Australian waters up to 70 years. It can reach 6 meter in length and 2000 kg in weight. It has several rows of triangular teeth. The great white shark leads a solitary life. Solitary means secluded. It doesn't live in colony. Okay, next is the saltwater crocodile. Is the largest reptile in the world and the biggest terrestrial predator. It can have up to seven meter and nineteen hundred kilogram. The crocodile can live in salt water, but it usually stays where the rivers flows into the ocean. It can be found from Asia to Australia. Next is the southern. Uh, right whale the sudden right whale can reach up to 90 tons and 18 meter it can live to 100 years in the winter it migrates north the whale population is currently estimated at 
टेन थाउजेंड वेल्स फीड ऑन प्लैंगटन नेमली माइक्रोस्कोपिकल ऑर्गेनिजम्स दैट लिव इन द ओशन ओके दिस इज द बिगेस्ट वन यू कैन सी दैट द वेट इज ओवर नाइन्टी टन्स अप टू नाइन्टी टन्स डॉक्टोपस डॉक्टोपस इज अ मॉलस दैट हैज अ सैक शेप बॉडी अ माउथ विद स्ट्रॉन्ग जॉज टू बिग आईज एंड एट टू टेन लेम्स टेंटिकल्स विद सक्शन कप्स द लार्जेस्ट कैप्चर्ड ऑक्टोपस हैड टू सेवेंटी टू किलोग्राम एंड नाइन मीटर लॉन्ग टेंटिकल्स ऑक्टोपस इज फीड Uh, feed on oysters fish and crabs the clown fish the clown fish is bright orange with three white stripes it reaches up to 9 cm in length and lives in large groups the clown fish lives in hidden places among rocks it gets along very well with other f- uh, fish species in an aquarium the clown fish feeds on both algae and meat here this is just like a nemo if you have seen the movie of ne- uh, nemo this was the clown fish and uh, it is very beautiful and you have seen that it also lives in colonies okay now we are going to solve the mcqs how many animals in the picture live on land as well as in water okay now we are talking about the picture uh, octopus fish definitely on uh, definitely in water whale in water crocodile it lives in land and water both then uh, sea uh, sea lion it also lives in land and water and penguin so in total there are three three animals that live in land and water you can't say four because these two are the penguins the categories uh, the species are different but both are penguins so you are not going to co- count it separately in total there are three animals that live on land and in water which of the animals from the picture can weigh 40 tons now here you can see it was written over here that uh, the right whale can reach up to 90 tons so it definitely it means that 40 ton and um, weight will be of the southern right whale so whale is the correct option so how many animals from the picture live in large groups or colonies now you have to count uh, in colonies clownfish it live in it lives in colonies sea lion lives in colonies and uh, the little blue penguin lives in colonies here it is mentioned it lives in a very large colony and here the royal penguin you, now you have to count because here it is separately mentioned it lives in colonies so in total there are four species that live in uh, four animals that live in colonies next which of the animals from the picture are mammals namely they give birth to live young okay now which one uh, give birth to the young one the sea lion and the whale okay the salt water crocodile no it lays eggs the blue penguin it also lays eggs a uh, great white shark yes shark is mammal is considered mammal uh, some of the shark they uh, they produce um, the young ones then the royal penguin no it is wrong octopus no it is wrong so the sea lion and the whale they both are mammals they feed their young one and they give birth to their young one which of the animals from the pictures reproduce by laying eggs which animals give, uh, lay eggs penguin crocodile and octopus here in the picture you have seen penguin penguin lays eggs okay and then crocodile lays eggs and octopus lays eggs so the option of uh, this one uh, this is correct okay because uh, here the fish is the clown fish it is not mentioned here so this option is correct penguin crocodile and octopus how many animals from the picture rep- reproduce by rows rows i told you that these are the eggs of the fish all the fishes they are produced by the egg that are called rows and they are also eatable these eggs are also eatable so how many animals two animals because here you can see this the clown fish and the other fish is the the great white shark okay the great white shark it also uh, it is also produce it also produces eggs you can't say the right whale because this is a mammal okay this is mammal so there are uh, two two animals number 19 which, what animal from earth can reach the largest size the largest size is whale definitely uh, elephant crocodile octopus whale shark here you have to see the weight uh, 
it is having 18 meter the uh, 90 tons and 18 meter but the crocodile is 7 meter only and octopus is just uh, you can say the size is uh, 272 kilogram and 9 meters just the 9 meters so the uh, so this the southern right whale shark is the largest one so whale is the correct option okay what's the name of the smallest penguin species the smallest penguin species is the blue penguin it is written in the description what are the three heaviest animals in the picture in increasing order of their weight now you have to see it is increasing order of their weight first uh, it means that the last one will be the heaviest one okay so this option is correct the crocodile the great white shark and the whale now you have to compare their weight this uh, right whale it is having um, 90 ton weight okay then the crocodile is having 1900 kilogram okay and then uh, sorry Yes, 1900 kilogram and it is 2000 kilogram. So the smallest is this crocodile, then the greatest is the white shark, and then the greatest is of whale. Okay, uh, you have to read the question very carefully because you have to answer what is asked for in increasing order of their weight is crocodile great white shark and then the whale okay what are the three largest animals in the pictures in decreasing order of their length now you have to see their length and this is the correct option the whale it means that the length of the the, the length of the whale is the largest then the lesser would uh, lesser would be of the great white shark and then the crocodile okay you can see the length from the picture it is written some animals illustrated in the pictures are endangered species because why because they have been hunted i told you over here in the last uh, line it is written that they are see being excessively uh, hunted for meat fat or are endangered species because they have been hunted okay number four, 24 the animals that don't live in water are yes cola sharks they live in water penguins live in water whales live in water octopus live in water so cola is the correct option cola is is the correct option okay that's all for uh, this paper of 2020 i hope you have understood uh, inshallah we are going to proceed with the next paper of class 5 and 6 okay thank you so much allah hafiz